Okay, we're back for some more thrilling Napoleonic action. And what could be more thrilling than the Austrian invasion of Paris? And this is the, uh, the central territory in uh, France. Uh, in this game, it covers most of the territory of what we traditionally call France. But, um, yeah, we have quite a little fight here. My best army, 90%, 90, 95% rested, going up against a fresh but green army of, uh, well, a large army in Paris without a general and a smaller army outside Paris with general who will be coming in and giving me some grief late in the game. All right. Um, well, let's see what happens. The siege of Paris. Here we go. Now the siege is ending. The battle of Paris, 1806. Who would have thunk that Paris would ever be threatened in 1806? How cool, what? Eight years before it historically was taken? Well, uh, French priorities were elsewhere, namely northern Italy. Very important area in 1806. Very important. Um, however, losing Paris would be a bad thing that is uh, traditionally believed. All right, what do we got here? It's not raining. That's nice. Got a big glob of trees in the middle of the French army. Looks like uh, a bunch of cavalry on the right, on their right, and a bunch of infantry and guns on their left. Okay. I appreciate that I'm able to see them, that my superior general allows me some benefit. What is the terrain like? It looks, uh, it looks like, well, there's a lot of trees, but this doesn't look like terrible ground to put my cannons in there. Very experienced cannons. There's only three of them, but very experienced cavalry too, including heavy cavalry, the cuirassier, along with uh, some hussars and Archduke Johann and, uh, well, what the heck are those? More hussars, okay. All right. A wide mix of very experienced infantry. Very exciting. It's nice to know that my boys won't run at the first sign of trouble. But where to put my guns? There's no obvious hills and there's lots of trees. There's, can there's cavalry on this side. I like shooting guns at cavalry. That's always fun. I just, I don't know. It looks really flat to me. See, it looks really flat and then it won't be. Drives me crazy. Uh, 
I don't mind setting up my army on their right. But I always start with the guns. Unlimber the guns. And set them up right there. Does that make sense? I keep wanting to push them farther and farther to my right. But if nothing else, we're going to take lots of pop shots at their cavalry. All right, now where are the infantry at? That's all the infantry. All right. Well, let's put uh, let's put three units. Just three units. That's what we got there. Like the worst unit in the army. And some grants. Yeah. I don't think they're gonna hit my right very hard because they're already. Well, already out there. So it's good to cover your mouse before you speak into a microphone. Remember that. That's my advice for today. Cover your mouse before you speak into a microphone. I don't have anybody in the trees, do I? Not yet. Three strong units of cavalry. I'll put them on my right. There we go. And the rest of that cavalry, two units on the left. I'll worry about them later after I get the rest of the infantry figured out. Alright, cavalry, those three dudes, and then everybody else. Let's see. How's that look? Is that line too thin? Looks a little thin. Oh, well, maybe not. That's three wide. This one drops down to two wide, but that's these are well trained troops. These guys will be able to come out on my flank. But uh I'm not worried about that so much. These guys, uh, we're not gonna, not gonna move forward too quickly this time. The advantage of having quality guns. What are these? Twelve pounder, seven pounder. It cannot escape. You cannot, uh, cannot have a fight without a three pounder. I gotta say, that doesn't look like Paris. I appreciate that there's a big church in the center of town, although it doesn't look like a Gothic cathedral, but... What do you gotta do? They only have so many maps they can put in. You can't have a map for every city in, in Europe. Okay, are we set up? I think we're set up. Ah, 
My guns, except for the three pounder, are shooting. Do, do, do. All right, come get a taste. Do I have any special units in this thing? I probably do, but it's such a very, a very, 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 very varied group. That's okay. My cannon's having any luck shooting anything. Killed, killed a couple of them. Didn't kill any of them. They all moved over to my infantry side, away from my guns. Well, that was smart, I guess. Make them think twice. Their guns aren't targeting me yet. That's good. Uh, maybe they're going to bunch up here in the woods and then slowly move their way forward and hit me with all their guys that force marched all at once. It could happen. Oh, today I'm using my mouse on a different table. Because I notice when I listen to these videos that uh, the biggest sound outside of the game and outside of myself is this clicking and whirling of my mouse. So uh, we'll see how it sounds without that. Although it's slightly irritating because my hand is so used to being in one place instead of where it is. But that's okay. I'm not sure we're hitting anything with our guns now. So maybe it wasn't a great idea to set up so far to the right, but I am sort of curious what they're going to make of my boys lining up here on their <laughs> lining up here on their extreme left if they're going to go out there they're going to get shot by my cannon do need to keep an eye on the time because yeah I do because they're gonna get reinforcements and those reinforcements are gonna make the game go longer so I can't afford to take too long but uh, I will let, let some things happen here on my right before I do anything more drastic, I do appreciate that their cannons haven't sighted me yet. They haven't shot, shot at my cavalry or any of that kind of rudeness. But 
Okay, I'm getting impatient. So I will uh, move these guys closer. Yeah, I'm pretty sure my cannons aren't shooting at anything right now. Or they're not hitting anything right now. Maybe I will move them. One by one, I'll move them. Starting with the three pounder, the one that's doing the least. I appreciate that their cannons still aren't sighting me. Even though they're right there, and I'm right here, whatever you do, you do you. <coughs> you play your game. If I'm just totally baffling you, then well, I guess that's just the way it is. So, as I move my guns this direction, I'm curious to know if uh, I'm curious to know if um, if they're going to swing back to the, to my right because they aren't going to get shot in the flank anymore. <clears throat> yeah, they're moving, uh, moving cavalry around, and that always makes me itchy. coming okay well it's not like they have great defensive setup they're pretty much out in the open except for those big old trees which is just as much a hindrance to them as it is to me I think I will divide up my troops further
Well, what do you think about that, Mr. Unnamed French General? What do you think about that? Yeah, maybe that's not going to work out so well. What are you doing? Uh, distractions. All right. Pause for a second. Where am I? Okay. Uh... I am, okay, I am on the flank, okay, looking at the French left, where they have remarkably few troops, oh, right there. And because they just don't seem to care about all right they just don't seem to care about the troops out there perhaps they shouldn't Maybe they're nothing special. I don't notice any troops here in the woods. Ah, oh, they're shooting at me now with their cannons. They've decided to wake up. And they're shooting at me with their guys. I mean, I'm shooting. Oh, there's a guy there. Okay. Where are the rest of their guys? I'm playing on the thick trees setting, so it's hard to see. The heaviest gun is still way the hell over here. Okay. Are you firing? Yes. Well, this is cool and all, but we might as well just uh, go up there and push that guy out of the way, don't you think? As safe as I'm taking it, they're taking it even more safe. All right, we have a gun in place.
We have a second gun in place. We must blow them to pieces. Blow them to pieces. Blow them to pieces. We must hit their cavalry and hit them hard. All right, you guys start to angle more and more that direction. Their cavalry are going to get involved any second now. Just go in there and push those guys out of the way. There's only 78 of them. routed those guys. Oh. I think they... They're charging into the woods against my cavalry and I missed it. And now this guy is going to rally behind my lines. Okay. Push that guy out of the way. Now, you need to join up with this lot. Alright. My guns are shooting, my men are shooting their guys. There, there he is. I need you to hurry up, boys. Don't want to lose my guns, do I? Give them the canister, boys. I thank you for charging my squares in the wood. Are they done? 49 out of 108? They might not be. Although, frankly, they don't have a general, so it's not entirely fair. Blow the snot out of these guys. I have cavalry over here, right? Yes. You. Go over there and make these guys question their life choices.
the cannons are not doing very much. Charging into the woods against French line infantry and line concerned. They should be concerned. There's a jerk over here shooting my dudes. They're about to pop. Reinforcements are coming on. How are these guys still here? Please kill these guys. There you go. Understand them trying to win a fight here. I'll turn these guys on their edge. Now they're shooting their cannons at my leader. Very gauche. Alright. Save your Took care of that guy. Now, come back. And you. <laughs> what general is that? Oh, I forgot. I forgot which marshal that just threw his life away. Oh, I appreciate you uh, coming close enough to my cavalry to let me kill him. All right. You're not still chasing down that guy, are you? I need you to come back. Might need you someday. Why are my cannons doing, like, no damage to anybody? It's like they're... Well, they might be on a slope. They're just making everything difficult. But that would surprise me that I'm just totally unable to damage people. Guys got a little bit beat up fighting those other cavalry. Uh, I don't think they're coming back with 46. So how do you like that, boys? Oh, what?
So yeah, I think yeah, the those are the new units coming on. Yeah. Out of nowhere. Guard Curassiers. Full strength. Rested. And he's coming behind my lines because why not? These guys are fresh. But they're not as good as the first four horse guards either. But these guys seem intent on going after my infantry, which is probably smart. Although if I have a lot of cavalry left at the end of the fight, that is only bad news for them. Are these guys getting... Okay, they're under artillery attack. That's fine. I am glad about that. Because it's the truth. Couple of my guys. These guys are gonna pop. They're both gonna pop. I think. There's a big giant cavalry unit here in the woods. And, and another one right here, but these guys are on square, right? Yes. Except for these two guys on the edge. Far enough out of reach. Uh, another one. Alright, this guy saved himself. But. Try to shoot their cavalry with cannons. It is always my playbook. Kill these guys. I don't like using my cavalry against their cavalry. That doesn't always go very well. Used to just stay in square. don't think you're going to be able to break my squares. There you go. Get popped. Alright. Reform boys. these guys. Kill these guys. Kill all, kill all their cavalry. It just gives me gas. up the mess. Mm. 
All right. Free farm, boys. You can leave square finally. those guys thank you for popping Please kill these guys. I know you're tired. Oh, you're exhausted, no less. But you only gotta take out some guns. You can do that. You can do that. Thank you. Two units of guns. All right, now save yourself. You guys. Advance. Advance. Now the guns are gone. They can't target my generals easily. French are coming in from up here, but their guns. I have enough cavalry to ride them down. A gun, a gun, a gun. Are you fresh? I can't believe this. This is too perfect. these guys rally <sighs> 70 out of 184 and they rallied up those guys and give them a tough day. Ooh, damn it. And I have to go kill those 70 guys. Or, no, that's not their leader. Damn it. Yes. <sighs> 
getting ripped up. You go over there. I don't know what's going on in here. Not much. Okay. Oh. It's time to reform them, boys. over here anyways. I sent a uh, unit of cavalry to go deal with that. Did they decide not to go? We did. Busting up those guys is more important. another unit of cavalry around here someplace. Showing any extra cavalry anywhere, so I'm I I sent a, an out a unit out there to kill those today. I don't see a bunch of horse carcasses. Oh, I guess there are horse carcasses. Looks like we did did a number on those guns though. Well, that's something. Uh, right. out of 83. There's one more unit over here, boys. That's a small one. You can take them before these guys get here. No. 
Got a new enemy here, boys. Give all these guys a good pop. These guys are availing themselves very well, considering that they had no general of renown at the start of this fight. Did you guys route? No. Well, let's see. What am I going to do with my boys? What am I going to do with all you guys? Set you up uh, out here. any cavalry left at the end of this. That's our fresh unit. They're coming over to snake my last guy over here. Their general is still here. Not making any moves. Another general. Well, I'm going to call him a general. It looks like these guys just want trouble. Not sure what formation that's supposed to be. It looks like we don't quite know what we're doing formation. It's not square. That's the important bit. Chop them down, boys. These guys are shooting into the backs of this unit, which is about to pop. Interesting. I lose my guns. Hmm.
Shoot big holes in those guys. They're all small units. General can go ahead and get behind the line too, I guess. Just this once. Alright, I didn't have to use my cavalry to route that guy. Another fresh infantry unit. What do we got going on here? I've let my boys get a little bit disorganized. And one of my guns got routed. But it cost them a unit. They don't have very many units left. And most of the units are small. My units have been ripped to shreds, but they're still here. Fresh. Very tired. You, fresh boy. Come over here. you gonna save me some trouble. Give some rally support to those boys. Yeah. I, I know you're being shot by young guys, but this is worth it. Exhausted. Charged in the flank. Being shot at. They're, they're losing guys very quickly. My boys, on the other hand, 
faring, not faring so great. <sighs> oh, that was their, that was the big unit they had left. And we just wiped out almost half of it. Right down those fools. Splag. I think we're gonna keep hitting them so that they don't come back. Ay! Ay! Stop hitting us with your sabers! Org! Okay. Come back. Shoot those guys in the face. Splick. Got another gun. But I'm writing them down too. If I win this, and it's pretty clear that I'm on the way to victory here, then uh, <laughs> I'm probably going to loot Paris for all it's worth, because I don't know if this army will be able to hold it. Shoot the snot out of those guys. Well, there's, the leader is still over there, but I should probably get the youth infantry back in the fight. I probably could have saved my gun had I done things very slowly and methodically. But. See, do any of these guys have any size at all? These guys in the 80s. This guy's in the 80s. So we're gonna come over here and shoot at this cavalry guy until he leaves. Oh, this guy's 170. Where, where have you been? These are going to leave or they're going to charge me in a form square. At least that's the plan. There is a cannon over here with 12 guys in it. That is enough. And uh, it even has a gun somehow. <laughs> this kind of still pouring grape shot into running French. That is just ah, all right. I need you boys to stay rallied. Yes, if their cavalry are going to stand there, then you can shoot them until you run out of ammo or what have you. I'm going to worry about that gun last. That's a grenadier unit. Might as well bring them up too.
I appreciate you standing there and letting me shoot you. Um, I had a cavalry unit over here, didn't I? Or did it go away? Can I range on that guy? I thank you for standing there, taking it like, oh, a fool. We're not very good shots. Listen for the horns, boys. If their horns blow, that means they're charging. Okay, well that was a sound. Are they just gonna leave? Oh, my cannon did bust that guy up. Good. destroyed both of your armies and I killed your other marshal lost 48 guys without inflicting a casualty by yourself and oh this oh, come on the game is we're almost out of time and there's nothing is there anything I can do oh, I need you guys to route I have seconds. I always lose track of time. Need you to route. Route. Route, damn you, route. Route? How about we route? think they'll let them win if they're routed. <sighs> Always take my eye off the clock. I don't think it gets any closer than that. Ah. Feel, felt very good. Let's see, I went in with 2,700 guys. I lost 1,400. 50% uh, casualties. They lost everybody. 3,600 guys. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, here we go. I can peacefully occupy and get predicted wealth of 5,600 or I can loot it for 54,000. I think I'm going to loot it. Ah! Somebody who just loves Paris. I have to loot it. I'm going to take all the stuff that you've been taking from other countries and I'm going to keep it. <laughs> and there's going to be amazing museums in Austria instead of France. Settlement looted. 55,000 bucks in Paris burns. Uh, I don't think I'm going to be able to, I just don't think I'm going to be able to keep it. The Parisians will be so angry with me. that they will uh, revolt. Fifty five thousand and taking Paris from them felt feels very well very very good. And if I exempt them from tax I exempt them from tax, they still have all these fists right here. So, screw it. You go, go ahead and keep your tax. In fact, I'm going to go ahead and mark your military buildings for destruction. Because, because I am just a terrible, terrible person. And then I'm going to get out of town. Go back home. Now I left that city empty, so I have to put people in there. I know I have some people around here someplace. Okay. There. Okay. Uh, all my cavalry. Or maybe not all of it. Some of it? I thought for sure I had some guys who could reach that. There. Just sitting there and uh, keep the people happy. Anybody else? You too. Go sitting there and keep the people happy. Nobody else can make it. Okay. Yes, that was enough to keep the people happy. All right. All right. Ah, uh, well. I'm tired. I have uh, phone calls to make, and uh, I'm going to call it done. We have successfully conquered Paris and taken most of France. So you look up those victory conditions, you'll see this is all green now because I've taken this area. Aha! Anyways, this is Jomo Rising, signing off.